Microsoft is reportedly purchasing the site of the 1979 nuclear meltdown in Pennsylvania to power AI. This is largely concerning considering how much power we're allowing tech firms to have and how power hungry and inefficient AI really is. We can have a power plant that could run an entire city and then some running Microsoft AI. And while that $16 billion deal is going through, OpenAI has claimed to create the first thinking AI model. They're also threatening to ban users for asking their new model, Strawberry, how it thinks. As it turns out, AI is difficult to control and they can't quite keep it from telling its secrets. Which is kind of funny because you can't actually ask AI how many R's are in Strawberry, it will give you the wrong answer. This is partly to do with how literal AI is. How many R's are in Strawberry? Do you mean how many of the sound are? Or do you mean how many instances of the letter R? Give it a shot. The sheer power hungriness of this thing is kind of disturbing considering how just ineffective it is. And we know when AI trains on self, it collapses. And we haven't quite figured out how to fix that problem. The worst case scenario is that we make AI relatively effective and we all learn to rely on it before it ultimately collapses and everyone forgot how to do things.